Welcome all back to the channel, guys. I'm Prime Skylanders here. We're back for the third installment of Skylanders Skylanders Swap Force. Now, for this, um, I want you guys down below, I want to make sure I say it right at the beginning, I want you guys to comment what you guys think possibly might be my top characters or whatever, my top three. Um, also, I want you guys down to comment down what are your top three favorite characters from this game. If you guys, if this is your first video you guys are watching, out of the thingy and bobos, what I'm doing is I'm choosing my top three favorite characters from this whole entire game swap for actually I want you guys to stick to to the end because in this game there actually is going to be a little surprise towards the end um, so you guys are going to have to watch the whole video to see kind of what the quick little surprise is but I chose my top three favorite characters these all three are swappers um, and then you'll f see why and figure everything else out towards the end of the video you'll get everything figured out so we're going to jump right into my third number three favorite swapper Blah blam. There it is, guys. That is Spy Rise. For those who do not know, Spy Rise is an amazing character. Multiple attacks. You know, when I talk about multiple, oh my gosh. Multiple leg attack, multiple arm attack. Um, I mean, he's even got the goggles. That's one thing I love about Skylanders is when they have multiple attacks. If they have, like, three basic attacks, but they're really powerful, it, it's alright. Um, when they're very beneficial, you know, I might only have basically like three attacks. But then when you have a character that can do, that are that's strong and can do multiple attack, like shooting up into the air, shoot down lasers, um, flamethrowers from his feet, cannons from his feet, um, like wrists, I forgot what the thing was, like shooting out stuff out of his wrist and then even a laser from his eye or something, that is a really good character. Um, he was amazing to get. Everyone was really pumped up. He came out of Wave 3. Oh my gosh. I remember. I didn't get him for a while. But he's still a great character. And another reason why I chose him. His base looks good with every character. That is one thing that um, will benefit some of my opinion. Is if the ba you know swappability in this game. So his base. You know it looks great with nearly pretty much every swapper. It does. Will look great with those robot legs. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and move on to number two. And it probably, I feel like some of you guys most likely would have guessed it, is Washbuckler. They did a really good job with the starter pack for uh, uh, Giants and Swap Force because they both, both one of the characters made it into my um, top three list. Washbuckler is an amazing character. I love his um, voice acting. I love his lines that he says. Really good job with his voice. The attacks. Just thing like Spy Rise, he does many attacks when you go down the right path, and it's quite amazing. I love Piranhas and the Bubbles. That just made me laugh. when I when I saw that I was like, oh my gosh, this is awesome. <gasps> Piranhas are so cool. And then just the idea. Um, if you guys ever seen um, was that boy uh, Skyland or I'm about to say Skyland Boy Girl um, uh. Shark Boy and Lava Girl, where they actually did have piranhas and bubbles. That reminded me just of like that. It was awesome. Um, another thing about it is his octopus legs. Just like um, Spy Rise. Oh, I just didn't realize about the climbing ones. Huh. Call me bias on that, on the climbing. Um, but um, his legs. Most characters, I think every character will look amazing with his octopus legs. Just, it just looks really amazing. The voice acting, oh, the voice, I really did like the voice actor for him, and then I remember watching someone video, I think it was Coin Up, uh, where they actually did the stink bomb and him, uh, got to meet them, I was like, oh, I mean, voice acting is incredible, character incredible, uh, really solid character all in all, and the soul gym though, really cool, the ghost ship. Did y'all guess it right for number one? My number one pick is Free Ranger. I feel like some of you guys probably would not have guessed Free Ranger. Free Ranger was an amazing character. Ever since I very first saw him, um, I remember I was watching this guy on a boy and girl, and they said it was an, a crocodile, and I was super excited. And then it really did look like it, just kind of how the toy was posed, and we were everyone was kind of looking at it wrong. Um, and, but then we were like, oh, wait, that's a beak, and then you can see, oh, it's a chicken, a storm chicken. Um love the laser eyes the weapon i think it's a unique weapon i'm i'm don't hold me to that i don't think anyone has weapon like his i don't know what they're called but the double bladed uh kind of like boomerangs kind of but they don't launch out type thing really awesome one of my favorite poses inside the tornado oh that's super cool being able to pick up enemies and stuff inside the tornado um and then i don't remember i think you could also do that with sheep um, yeah, you can do that with sheep. I remember that. Oh, man, that was really cool. 
So he was definitely one of my favorite characters, and just, I don't know why, he had a really good feel with him, like, like the pose was awesome, but the feel of playing with him had a really good feel with him. And then now, I'm, this is going to be something, I feel like something I'll probably fast forward for it, I don't really care, but now it's time for the special surprise, and that surprise will happen in 3, 2, 1... And this was the special surprise, guys. It was my favorite core character. I, I was wondering if anyone was going to catch on that I only did swappers. Because I know I was going to do my top three favorite. Um, I just couldn't choose. Um, just there was, Those are my three favorite swappers. And I was like, I had to put in a core character. I didn't want to make it all about the swappers. This right here was my favorite core from the game. He, uh, he came close with Grim Creeper. Um, them two are really close. But Frino... Uh, series 2 front I do have, um, I got him a uh, buy one get one free, he is not that bad, but I would have to say though the first front was the best, got the better pose, just really unique, I know how they did that, when, you know, when you got the angry bike, that's one thing that's something that I knew with the new roller brawl, when you get a certain amount of anger, by just playing with them over a certain amount of time, they get access to kind of more damage and different kind of attacks, due to anger growing, anyways guys, that was my favorite swap force characters, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Yeah. Favorite vi I hope you guys enjoyed this video. There we go. Please subscribe for more content um, and all that good stuff that you guys know how to do. And I hope you guys stick around my channel for more Skylander 6 stuff that should hopefully be revealed soon and more of this new Skylander stuff. Hope you guys enjoy. And my name is Prime Skylanders, and I'll see you guys back in another video. <laughs> Get me right in there, get me right